it's Amanda, and I wanted to come to you briefly on a topic today, my dear friend. And that, friend, that topic today is giving thanks, transcending obstacles. Now, I stand on, let the redeemed of the Lord say so, whom he have redeemed from the hand of the enemy. So I never jump on any of these scopes and claim to have it all together. See, in 1 Thessalonians 5, it states, um, rejoice forevermore, and everything give thanks. Pray without ceasing and everything give thanks for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. And we bind up any type of retaliatory demons and principalities that will be trying to come in against us to hinder this. To that we say break. And we also say that no weapon formed shall be able to prosper. My dear friend, this message is not for everybody, but this message is for somebody. It's about giving thanks and transcending obstacles. See, what we need to realize is that God is a God, hallelujah, that executes righteousness and judgment for all that are oppressed. Us. We go from faith to faith and we go from glory to glory. You got to learn how to stand on the truth of his words and say things like the memory of the righteous shall be, be blessed. Hallelujah. Even now there are demonic entities that are attempting to interfere with my thought and my speech patterns. So that we say break and get thee behind. See we shift spiritually but devil you can't take my praise. Hallelujah. My friend as long as you have a inner praise within your spirit he shall yet of abundance and you can fight whatever forces are coming against you for darkness hallelujah for God said he won't do wickedly and he won't pervert judgment and in Joel 2 God states that he'll restore the years that the canker worm and the locust in the earth hallelujah these demonic entities thought they were going to cast a dark shadow over my continents into my phone and into my home hallelujah but god said in psalm 91 no evil shall befall us and no plague will come nigh our dwelling hallelujah we have many many things to give thanks for and first off let's lift up the children in prayer and say we stand on isaiah 54 13 that all of our children shall be taught of the lord and great shall be the peace of our children god says that children are a gift from god and the fruit of the womb is a reward Lord. Happy is the man's quiver or home that's full of children. He shall yell of abansia. We bind up that foul spirit of demonic separation from loved ones. Hallelujah. How good it is for the brethren to dwell together in unity. God is not the author of confusion. Love no false oath. He has the ministry of reconciliation. I'm giving thanks today, my dear friend. We didn't come to play patty cake with hell. Hallelujah. We came to stand on God's word and say we're transcending obstacles in the midst of adversities. He shall yell of abansia. God said there would be a afflictions but he would deliver the righteous out of them all hallelujah he who is without sin you cast the first stone hallelujah because those that rejoice in others calamity shall not go unpunished so do you have a telltale choir talking about they don't got enough money what they gonna do now hallelujah we serve a miraculous miracle work in God that gives seed to the sower who gives bread to the eater and he said the sower soweth the word hallelujah eat shut out of abasia that God's people will be the head not the tail above only not beneath that they shall lend and not borrow oh shut out of abasia thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven Hallelujah. You've got to learn to become ye separate. Hallelujah. How can two walk together unless they be in agreement? See, part of the problem, hallelujah, and trying to transcend obstacles is not so much as we're not grateful or thankful. Hallelujah. But Judas and Lot can't go. Hallelujah. But while men slept, an enemy came into the camp and sold tears. How can they bind up the strong man and enter his house and spoil his goods unless they bind up the strong man first? Hallelujah. you got to learn to tell that devil, get me behind. Hallelujah. Baby, I love you. Hallelujah. But I gotta be ye separate. Because Jesus was moved with compassion. He was a a hallelujah of God that showed compassion to the people. He shut He's our savior, our example. Who shut Bakuya. Now I'm not a theologian, so I don't want to get stoned at the plank. We're just here talking about hallelujah, how giving thanks will allow you to have the fuel you need to transcend every obstacle that may come against you. Hallelujah. You gotta have this mindset of faith. Well, shayara babasi tarosatab. Have an expectation of what God can do. If he did it before, he can do it again. He Shut up, bro. Oh, rabba, baba, bakuya. Hallelujah. Be quick to repent. He shut up, rab. For in James 4, it says, Humble yourself in the sight of the Lord, he'll lift you up. We're talking about giving thanks and transcending obstacles. Hallelujah. Not every little thing the devil come against us crying and hiding under a rock. He shut up, rab. We got to have fortitude and root within ourselves to know that God is able to do exceedingly and abundantly beyond what we can think or imagine. And that's why it's part of transcending obstacles. Hallelujah. 
hallelujah, in addition to giving thanks, requires, hallelujah, getting rid of this attitude of condemnation and humiliation. Oh, shayat of Abansi, for God having given us the spirit of fear, but a power love and a sound mind. That devil wants you walking around with your head lowered and cowered down. Oh, my wick have is showing. Praise God. He shall get a babasia, but God tells us, cast not away your confidence, for it has a great recompense of reward. Don't let that devil dictate to you and tell you what to do. Hallelujah. Yeah, we're a humble and a peaceful and a meek people. Hallelujah. But we're also a people of power. For the kingdom of God suffereth violence, and the violent taken by force. He shut up. We're giving thanks. Hallelujah. In the midst of what's happening in the economy, in our communities, we speak continue peace. Hallelujah. Despite what that devil tried to throw in our direction. We're giving thanks. Hallelujah. We have a life and life more abundantly in Christ. Hallelujah. What shall we say to these things? If God be for us, who can be against us? Hallelujah. We're not looking for those character assassins. He shut up. Forgetting those things that be behind, we press towards the mark of the hot calling. Oh, shut up. God's people will never be ashamed. We're talking about transcending obstacles. Despite who's talking trash and greasy over your situation. You got to learn to say what God said. Does somebody got a cheap rat tap? But what you said, hallelujah, what you did last summer, oh, shy out of Babansia. God said, no man have put their hand to the plow and looking back is fit for the kingdom. Love keeps no account of the wrong done. And we're not, hallelujah, being compassionate toward not, you know, being considerate of those who may be going through different things in their lives. Hallelujah. We rejoice with those that rejoice. We mourn with those that mourn. But we don't give that devil no place. He shut up, Rabba God has given his angels charge over us to keep us in all of our ways. They shall bear us up in their hands, lest we dash our foot against a stone. Hallelujah. Be ye separate, my dear friend. Give thanks. Hallelujah. Have an expectation of what God can do. Stand on Galatians where it states, be not weary and well doing, for you shall reap in due season if you faint not. Hallelujah. We don't need a screen. Hallelujah. God is not going to revoke our miracle for the gifts and callings of God are without repentance. You tell the spirit, break in the name of Jesus. You ain't taking my miracle away. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. The secret of the Lord is with them that fear him and he'll show them his covenant. Hallelujah. We're pressing towards the mark. Hallelujah. In the midst of what's being thrown our way. Hallelujah. He says, if you think in the day of adversity, your strength is small. Think about those things that God have delivered you from before. Hallelujah. Get rid of this mindset of condemnation. There is therefore now no condemnation for those who are in Christ. Christ Jesus, who walk not after the flesh, but after the spirit, for the law of life in Christ Jesus has made us free from the law of sin and death. Learn how to say, I shall live and not die, and declare the works of the Lord in the land of the living. Oh, shatabra bababaku, yeah, because greater is coming. Oh, shatabra babaku, stand on your promise with all that you have within you, and despite what you see, learn that God can turn it around. Oh, He's calling us to a place of surrender, of giving thanks and saying, okay, God, I've gone as far as I can. Hallelujah. Now you got to heed to the instructions and we don't forsake the assembling of ourselves with other believers. I'm not counseling you. Hallelujah. I'm testifying. They overcame by the blood of the lamb and by the word of their testimony. Who out of order? I don't even want to sound defensive and have to speak back. Hallelujah. Testify by God's goodness. Tell somebody what God done in your life. Hallelujah. This is part of transcending obstacles. Hallelujah. No, we're not going to be defeated. Hallelujah. We're going to trust God. He shut up. We're going to keep pressing towards that mark. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord of the harvest and laborers into his harvest to assist. For he said the harvest have been plentiful, but the laborers have been few. We prayed and we called in the laborers. This harvest is not for hell. This harvest is for the God of heaven. Oh, shut up. Basia. Live, my friend. Dream. Hallelujah. Decree and declare what thus saith the Lord over your life. He speaks healing. Hallelujah. Prosperity. Long life. He shut up. Rababa Kuta Rosia. Develop the ethic of prayer. Who shut up. Rababa Kuta. Condition yourself to go to a private place and pray or pray corporately. Praise God. He shut up. Mamasia. Give him thanks. Will confuse the enemy. He shut up. When we say the enemy, we're talking about them dark principalities that don't want us to succeed. Hallelujah. We wrestle not against flesh and blood. He shut up. This ain't personal. Hallelujah. Give thanks and watch. God transcend the circumstances of life because the Lord will prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemies. God is the one that anoints our head with oil and it's the anointing 
that destroys the yoke. We don't want no dry anointing. We're going to give thanks. Hallelujah. And that's going to shut that devil down. Well, until next time, my dear friend, I'm looking forward to hearing your testimony. Shalom.